Hello friends, Shivansh this side and today I am going to show solution of puzzle solved by me which was actually solved by Ramanujan and I framed one more solution of the puzzle so actually that was my live attempt I thought I would get the answer in first attempt but still I won't able to get the answer in first attempt so I did it after three attempts in further video you would be able to watch this and this problem is a problem mentioned in strand magazine which is one of the best magazine in world and it has one of the most difficult riddles so let's start with the problem and then further you would be able to see the solution of the problem so mr dudney mr henry dudney wrote this problem and its original manuscript is goes like this a long street numbered on its side one two three and so on and all the numbers on one side of him added up exactly the same as all the numbers on other side of him okay that means we need to find the width of the street and also actually this problem was posed by mahabalness to ramanujan like he introduced him about this problem so i would be solving this problem in one more way in which i have assumed something so first of all let us understand the problem it means here am i like in the problem here am i the numbers before me are named and numbers after me are not named are numbered in natural number and continuous natural number for example one then a house two then a house three and i've considered it till n here is the guy standing then n plus 2 then till x so that means 1 plus 2 plus till n is equal to n plus 2 plus n plus 3 till x so let's see how i solve the problem and yes you can follow also us on quora find the link in description box thank you and please see the solution of problem made by me and yes if you know how ramanujan did it please do comment in comment box so let's come to the solution how i solved it i don't know how ramanujan solved it but i would show how i, how I solved it so first of all some ten is the guy sitting and numbers i hit him some till n which is n n plus 1 upon 2 okay so it will be equal to here is my x x x plus 1 upon 2 no because i need some from here to here yes i need it till here I don't want this which is included I don't want all these so what should I minus mm, okay let's minus first of all some till here and n plus 1 upon 2 pretty simple and what else should I minus can you suggest oh you suggested right minus n plus 1 so after this rough stuff I have reached to this result let's try solving it let's try cracking it I would like to take it here and would like to take it also here so so then this equation looks like like isn't it looking easy but it is not because it is only one equation and variables are two so what can we assume mm, okay let's assume that this condition is followed by infinite values or there are infinite solutions to this riddle so I can assume that x minus n is any number watch number you like okay I would take 5 
well five is not my lucky number but still let's try it's my first attempt only so pardon me yes but instead of substituting it directly here let's try to simplify it really strange big equation you know so what can i do first of all these two terms are alike so can i remove two from here and remove this yeah as it is really simple calculation it's like x upon 2 plus x upon 2 it is equal to x so i did it this also here i am seeing one n plus one and here is also n plus one let's take it common might be feeling alone so i can write it like this these two terms are same wow now let's i can call it like this which is oh please mind my handwriting which is equal to x x plus one upon 2 and instead of 5 if I take any other number then my calculation would be easy but I am taking 5 x is n plus 5 you know I hate calculations but what to do let's remove it and let's substitute the value n plus 1 is what was it oh I really forgot what was it I can't forget it. So now this problem looks easier like a quadratic equation or a linear equation. Can you guess which equation would it be? Can I tell you? Okay, without solving, I would tell you it would be quadratic. And you know, it's my first attempt, live attempt. If I would be wrong, I would not reshoot. I want you to see my this attempt also. Let's hope I won't be wrong. Actually, it when I would open these all things, these all brackets and the stuff, it would be a quadratic equation only. Because this polynomial would have degree 2. I would take 2 here. Then I would take here, I would get n square. Then I would subtract. Then here, I would get with n square only so that's quadratic let's apply it again 1 is equal to n square plus 5n plus 6n plus 30 upon 2 oh I really don't want this problem to go wrong as I did a lot of hard work haven't I? So I could write this like this also. Let's remove this also. Let's check to there. It would be sorry 2n square plus 4n plus 2. Let's check all them here. Minus n square minus 11n minus 30 is 0. Okay. 2n square n square n square plus minus can I say 7n and 2 minus 30 minus 28 is 0 I'm stuck with this quadratic and if n don't comes out to be natural my this hard works goes in vain oh that's really sad for me so let's try to solve it oh I'm inch fine to anything My first attempt went wrong. Actually, this won't give n as natural. It would get something else. Oh. Please suggest me a number, <laughs> lucky number, which I could take as n minus x. Sorry, x minus n. So this time, trying my luck, I would choose what I should choose 
okay simple number two so this time i tried my luck and choose number two oh i hope this would give me a real solution let's erase it it's of really no use it's really bad when you get to know that you're such hard work it goes in vain but yeah it's my live attempt i really first time tried to solve it so here what i get x is n plus 2 now step still this equation are pretty similar no so let's put n plus 2 instead of x n plus 1 whole square is n n plus oh really sorry oh really sorry n plus 2 into n plus 3 upon 2 I really this time don't want to fail n square plus 2 n plus 1 this time I will go fast because now you are genius with me How can I improve my handwriting? Can anybody suggest me? I would own. Let's write it again neatly. <laughs> n square plus 5n plus 6 upon 2. Let's shift this to there. And please, God, this time make us successful. 2 n square and I am directly shifting it here also 4 n plus 2 minus n square minus 5 n minus 6 is 0 computing n square minus n is oh I again fail minus 4 4, 2, 2. But this time I am thinking instead of this thing, I take 3. But I won't surrender to this problem. It would be 3, here it would be 4. And there I go. What would be amended here? It would be. Let's write it again. Laziness is not good. <laughs> so again, to here. 2n square plus 4n plus 2 is n square plus 7n plus 12. I would do solution directly right now. Minus 3n. Oh! I think I found it. Because 5, 2. But I will still try to compute. Because my luck is never good. <laughs> So, thank you number 3, but yeah I can't assure till now is 0, I did it, yes, wow, n, n minus 5, plus 2 and minus 5 is 0 and my cell you know I don't like writing this step I don't know why they make us write I am good I was good in calculation so I never wrote this step that means n is minus 2 n is you know n is element of this n so n is 5 wow and x is 8 well, now let's try this 
and this uncle and 5 x 8 so 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 is 7 plus 8 Ooh, I rock 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 is 15 it is 15 thank you for being with me for such a long time and if you have watched till here you might have been fascinated because maths is fascinating let's wrap this problem I solved the problem which Ramanujan solved Ooh. so okay right now I would also tell you about a calculator like it's not like an normal calculator it's pre it's available on Google Play Store its name is calc in and it is really amazing calculator it has I and really I haven't seen any calculator with I up till now it has hundreds of function predefined function it shows you graph of function oh, that's really great but I'm really happy I solved this problem live with you so that means the strand puzzle solved by me as well as Ramanujan and what was the result of Ramanujan can you tell me okay type in comment box and how was the video please comment and don't forget to like our channel like our video you can also follow us on Quora, find the link in description where you can share your theories based on universe. Please subscribe my channel and please share it to as many people as possible because no one in YouTube would provide you such quality content. There is no channel in YouTube who posts his own theorems, his own solutions on YouTube. And if there would be, I don't know. <laughs> but please, it's really a serious request. Please share my content. Please like my channel. Please like my videos. Please subscribe. Thank you.